is told about two widows who were diagnosed of, of, of cancer. They both went to the hospital to meet a doctor who gave them three months more to live. The first widow went home and prepared for her death. The second widow went home and started glancing and gazing at her children. After a little while, she turned to God in prayers, went on her knees on her small altar and cried to God, God, if I die now, who will take care of my children? Who will feed my children? Who will even send them to school? She said, God, I will not die. She prayed the prayers of Psalm 118 from verse 17. I shall not die. I shall live and recount the goodness of the Lord. This second widow lived for the next 33 years to see her children and even her children, children. Brothers and sisters, in the journey of faith, we don't lose hope. When you lose hope, you are like a man who got defeated even before going to the battlefield. The first woman lost hope. The second woman did not lose hope in God. And of course, her faith did not disappoint her. Today, God is calling us to live a life of faith. A life of hope in God. Hope is expectation of something good. When you are expecting death, it is not hope. When you are expecting calamity or doom, it is not hope. And so dear brothers and sisters, I don't know the situation you are in today. I don't know what you are passing through in life today. Only hope in the Lord. You remember the words of St. Paul in Romans chapter 5 from verse 5. He said that our hope in God shall not disappoint us. May your hope in God not disappoint you through Christ our Lord. Amen.